as I go through this day, you got my you got my footsteps and you take me where you want me to do, or where you want me to be. Amen. You feel me? So just remember to do that every time you get up in the morning, you know what I'm saying? Follow his voice. Step back, your thing now got shot. If you don't do it this way, you can't do that. No cap, real rap. So them said to me, me I grow my crap. I'ma not take back my chat. Them no know. Reaping on my soul. Them no know. And them enemies will grow. All the negativity, it cannot conquer. A video. For what? We just want to be my video, y'all. <laughs> Peace, love, light, wisdom, guidance, blessings, and discernment. Beautiful souls in this work. I don't know. We are not of this world. So we just finished our workout. We meaning me and God. <laughs> just kidding. Well, no, not just kidding. Me and God. And also my hubby and our daughter, right? So we just did our workout. And there they go over there. Y'all see them? Y'all see them? How y'all feel with this workout? You heard her? She's super good. She, what what you say? I'm super good because I didn't do anything. She's she hunting on a honey right now. You see that chest? You know what I'm saying? She getting right. But anyway, y'all, it was a great Be workout. On that honey. Ain't no, anyway, we getting right. Be hunting on that honey, but he don't got $100. I cannot with them. <laughs> Today was leg day. And let me tell you how those lunges, it wasn't it. Thank God I chose to do them last because I really, my asthma started acting up. I really had to think, but... What I've learned is that carbs, before you do leg day, you might want to, uh, carb you know, up. carb up carb up, and everything. What will happen was, is the day yesterday, I was on fasting, so I couldn't even carb up, right? So we're going to change our leg, leg day. days. We're going to change gonna the days to Tuesday and Friday. Now. So we're going to so change our bad. leg days. Yeah, Tuesday and Friday. Tuesday and Friday is leg day. So always remember. The foundation gotta be strong. The foundation has to be strong. The legs, this is most the most important. Oh, and when workout. you do like y'all probably already know this. Those of you that don't know this, you have to wait 48 hours before you work on your legs again. So like we did it today, 48 hours. You gotta do 48 hours. Anywho, y'all. Oh your girl. She is Still. Put it in, but my legs look good though. Put them in though. She put them in. She put them in. Yeah. Yeah. Guess what? So you know, next time we upping it up next. We upping it up next time. Ooh. <laughs> but yes, y'all. I just want to check in with you guys. Um. But anyway, come on, bud. But yeah, we about to go shopping right now. Um, but God is good. God is good. Work your body out. Do movement to the body, okay? Your body will thank you. Your mind will thank you. Your spirit will thank you, okay? Even your heart, your emotional space, I'm telling you, will thank you, okay? Um, look it up. When you Look at you. He found $6. I found $6 in the truck. Wow. <laughs> I, I need those. $6. No, you don't. Yes, I That's do. actually all Ouch. $6. That's actually $1. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> she got paid already. Uh -huh. You. I'm always getting paid. She was a banker. Cute. That's her little drawing. Good job. Anywho, guys, yes, make sure you put a movement to the body because your entire being will give thanks to you and to God for it, okay? And I always, you know, want to say this, like, when you are working out, bring God in the midst. Don't, don't let your motive and intention, remember, we do everything intentional, so don't let your motive and your intention for working out be, oh, I gotta get this nice tricep bicep i gotta get this nice booty i gotta get these nice legs i gotta get this that's just the cherry on top that's just the bonus but you should be wanting to get your spirit and mental and heart in alignment right okay i was sharing with my husband the other day that when i work out now now you know i we're also growing in christ and as i continue to grow in christ when i work out now and I, I come to a point where I, I don't feel like 
you know, I can keep going. And then he's like, oh, you got three more. Keep going. I don't think of the body that I want to have. I think of who I need to become in the spirit. Because God has told me, and I know a lot of you guys can agree with this, right? God has told me that where he's taking me, I need to be physically fit, spiritually fit, and mentally fit, and emotionally fit. I need to be fit in all ways, and not one or not the other. Not being physically fit and not spiritually fit. No, no, no. God said that's a no-no, right? So, he has shaped. Remember, the Bible says... We all have to be transformed by the renewing of our minds. So you got to deprogram some things. I'm telling you, you have to deprogram some things. So um, that's how I get through my workout. Today was tough, y'all. And I was trying to push. And then my asthma started, you know, getting the best of me. And I don't really take pumps and all that. So when asthma started acting up, I got to, like, chill. <laughs> but, yeah. So I'm challenging you today to... Um, you know, bring God in the midst of your workout and everything that you do, everything else that you do. Bring God in the midst and watch your transformation. I'm not saying it's going to be easy just because you brought God in the midst. It's actually, it's going to be a little bit more challenging because the enemy don't like that. But you can do it. You can do all things to Christ that strengthens you. I'm Amen. sure you know that. Any other words? Hey, man, y'all stay positive and y'all be blessed, man. I always stay on the right path. Just let God move your footsteps throughout the whole day. You wake up in the morning. Well, when I wake up in the morning, I always tell myself, like, hey, God, uh, as I go through this day, you got my you got my footsteps and you take me where you want me to do or where you want me to be. Amen. You feel me? So just remember to do that every time you get up in the morning. You know what I'm saying? Follow his voice. Listen to him. That's all I got to say. Amen. Any last words? Excuse me, ma'am. Any last words with your star glasses on? Yeah. Shout out to I Pinky in the building. Yes. So these shades is from the Pink World. Okay. I Pinky. I'm gonna put her link in the description below. She got so. Go get them, y'all. Don't so stay many. there. <laughs> okay. Go get them, y'all. Don't stay there. <laughs> y'all, the mimic in for, uh, episode 17, Coolie Baby Expresses podcast. Go watch that too. <laughs> but we love okay. you guys. <laughs> love you guys. Bless up yourself. You're done on the thing already. Anything opposite of life that I can't give